Hello guys and welcome back to another tutorial video. Today's one I'm gonna show you how you can record in pretty much any FPS. And uh, the games I would recommend for this is like Fortnite, CSGO, Minecraft and Overwatch. But yeah, basically what it does, at least uh, I'm recording at 240 FPS. I'm gonna explain later how you do everything. So yeah. I will have some gameplay playing right now in the background. I'm playing Overwatch and I have a video linked below where I play CSGO so you can see the difference. And yeah, look in the timeline if you just want to see the settings, how you do it. But yeah, the, uh, I also only know how to do this on Adobe Premiere editing program. So if you have another, just Google, I don't know, like... 240 FPS editing and then your editing program. But yeah, if you have Adobe, then you're in luck because I'm gonna show you at the end how you make this smooth gameplay. But don't go too much. Because let's say, uh, let's say you have 110 FPS in game average and you say like, oh, I'm gonna record in 240 FPS. No, no, no. Then it will only record in 110 and so on so don't just put that super high when you can't even run the game so i would only recommend this if you get 120 fps or more in a game that is the only use case i would recommend this for or like montages and stuff uh so yeah i'm gonna show you how you do it now so what you do is download OBS. I think it can be any OBS. There is three OBS Studio, uh, which is the one I'm using. And then there's one called just OBS and then OBS Streamlabs. And for this you need a fucking good PC. Uh, so yeah, advanced. I have this on high. I don't know if you really need that. Just so I rather my recorded video to not drop in frames and I rather drop frames in the, in the game. It never happens though so like uh, I don't know. Here set your resolution and then this. Put that on fuck I forgot what it's called now. It's not the common one. It's not the fractional. It's the other one. I can't check it because I'm recording right now. But it's the one where they say 1 at the bottom and then put the FPS you want to record in above that. Put your resolution here. Audio. Put your shit. And then here recording. I don't know if it's just for me. But for me to record at a higher than 60 FPS. I can only have one audio track. I don't know why. I let it. Like I can start it. Uh, like we, let's say boom I'm starting recording and then when I stop it just won't save I waited 15 minutes once and it just said saving recording so like it's it just doesn't work for me uh, it might work for you so test that out but if you can't save it you need to have one audio track which sucks because I have two for game audio and my mic and then these are my recording settings but with this, I had to turn down some stuff for it to um, keep up. And then limit your FPS in game too. And I had to do this. Boom. Uh, disable the preview. So yeah, that's the OBS side. Now let's open Adobe Premiere. Just make a... What do you call that? Project, I guess. And then just drag your video here. I mean, this is basic stuff shouldn't really need to show this but just in case you don't know and just wait for that boom here it is let's say I'm done now control M so we come to the export and then the important thing to make this work you need to have this at frame blending because you can't upload on YouTube anything above 60 FPS. So what this does is basically it blends all of those 240 FPS 
into 60 so that is why it's really blurry and looks like smooth I don't know but yeah did this guide help you then I would really appreciate a like and like I said I have a video where I play CSGO with the exact same settings pretty much in the comments if you want to see that and then I know there are videos on uh, Fortnite and Minecraft if you're more into that and want to see how that looks then just google that because I don't have them installed right now but yeah I hope this helped you if there's anything else let me know in the comments and I'll make sure to reply but I see you in the next one bye bye